Hey, how's it going, guys? All right, um, it's been a couple months, probably two months, and it's time for a small update on the aquarium. So, just a real quick uh, breakdown, recap. Um, haven't done anything to the aquarium, just trying to keep it clean, which is uh, actually the reason why we're here. But right, we'll get to that in a second. Um, anyhow, uh, because we're not doing anything to it until I move, so you know it's kind of pointless to start trying to do more and more to the tank and then move and have th bad things happen. So uh, what's happened is I have a huge outbreak of Aptasia. So today I decided, you know, enough's enough. You know, I have to do something to hold it back. And uh, we stopped at the stone. We picked up a new friend. All right, so we're going to turn to the aquarium here in a second and uh, give you a quick glimpse of what I mean by being out of control and what's happened. And then uh, you can see our new friend. All right, here we go. Okay, right now I have the lights turned off. So it's actually a pretty bad glare in here. Um, let me go over here. You can see that Aptasia right there. Looking really bad, right? Okay, but anyway, we have Aptasia pretty much everywhere. I put some peppermint shrimp in there in the last two months. And it didn't hurt. It, did, it didn't do anything. Like, you know, they're, they're not really interested. So today we are acclimating our new our new file fish. Anyway, uh, let me get a light on, get rid of some of this glare, and we'll get a better look at this. Alright, uh, so now you can see just what I'm talking about. Really bad. And um, I decided to leave the light off on that side that the fish is on. Why is acclimating? I just sort of wanna, you know, I think it's better with the light off. He's in there. He is right there. He's a good fish. Uh, hopefully he's uh, hungry for some Aptasia, right? So we're gonna see how this does in the next month, two months, and go from there. Right now I'm just holding it back from my from my mushrooms and my zoas. But I'm really, really just going crazy. It's going wild in there. All right, so uh, we'll cut the video back on in a minute, you know, probably 30 minutes or so while he's out, after he's acclimated. Check him out, give him a swim, and uh, until then, you know, let me just cut the video for now. Be right back. Well, okay, there's a little guy right there. I think the Aptasians are like bigger than him, so it's probably going to be a little while before he knocks this out. And um, he's hanging out in the aquarium pretty good right now. I got his attention, I was cleaning the glass, so he just kind of tucked up underneath the rock right there, kind of scared him. But you can see what he's working with right there, he's right in the middle of it. So, um, like I said, it might be might be a month before he can start knocking this down. I don't know, I'm going to give him some time. Like I said, he's really small. He's probably less than two inches, I'm not sure. But anyhow, you see what he's, what he's up against. And uh, so maybe, I said, like I said, he'll probably get really good going after a month. Anyhow, so uh, probably post up another one in about two months. Let's see how it went. Um, all right, look out for the next video. Uh, like, subscribe, and check out my other videos. I have a lot of other videos on, you know, I fly a drone, do some motorcycle riding, and, uh, you know, off-roading, and uh, some gaming, too, and check out my Twitch channel. Anyhow, uh, it's possible in my next video I might even move. I, I'm not going to say that I'm going to because it's not really, it's just something I know is going to happen in the future here. But until then, anyway, check back and uh, let's see how the safe page went.